In this video, I am using the US Olive Drab Set and Weathering Set for Green Vehicles from Vallejo. Both are from the AFV Painting Series. There are five bottles of paint and one bottle of satin varnish included with this set. Step 1. Primer. Primer is the best way to start off any painting job. This will give a smooth base for the top coats of paint to bite into. The primer does not need to be a thick coat. Apply the primer in thin, evenly sprayed coats, covering all of the surfaces of the model. It is best to allow the primer to cure before moving on to the paint stages. The curing time is typically 12 to 24 hours for larger models. The primer coat does not only seal the model, it also shows any flaws that you might have missed during the construction process. If you find anything that needs to be repaired after priming, simply fix that area and then follow it up with a quick light coat of primer to seal that area. Step 2. Applying the first base coat. In this case, it's Model Air Yellow Olive number 13. The first base coloring is applied to the lower sections of the model, concentrating on deep recesses and around raised features. It is not always an easy task painting a smaller scale models, especially with multi-tonal colors such as modulation or simple highlighting. Step 3. This is the application of a medium base color. This will be Model Air US Dark Green number 16. This color is applied over the lower areas of the piece as well as into the creases and around the surface structures. Although this is difficult with smaller models, you are not trying to cover the entire model with paint, only into and around the detailed areas. Step 4. The application of Model Air Olive Drab, number 43. Think of this as a mid coat of paint. This adds base tonal coloring to the model. You can apply this color to all open surfaces. Try not to paint directly into the corners or into recesses. Using a small piece of paper or masking tape, you can cover sections and prevent overspray. Step 5. This application is the highlight and final step of the painting process. In this step, we use Model Air Light Gray Green number 44. I am choosing to thin this final coat. I mix the light green gray about 50% with thinner. Typically I use Vallejo's Airbrush Cleaner for my thinner. I am applying this thin mix as a highlight coat, lightly applying the paint over all the horizontal surfaces. Step 6. This is the final step of painting this model. The Sealer Coat. The US Olive Drab Set comes with Vallejo's Satin Varnish. One or two thinly applied coats is all that is needed to seal the model. Once applied, and the satin varnish has had time to cure, typically 12 to 24 hours, we are then ready to begin the weathering process. The weathering set for green vehicles from Vallejo is one of two sets as part of their AFV Weathering Set line of products. The set is comprised of three bottles of model color paints, two model washes, one bottle of pigment, and one bottle of pigment binder. For this step, model color 822, German Camo Black Brown, is used. Paint this color over the entire tracks. This will be the base color to the weathering. While designed for weathering green tone models, this set can actually be used over many different color finishes.
While you have the German Camel Black Brown out, this is a good time to add some chipping to the surface of the model. To add chipping, take a small piece of sponge and dip it in the paint. Wick off the excess paint onto a dry paper towel. Lightly stipple the sponge onto the surface the areas where you want the chipping to be. Step 2 of the weathering process, the application of a rust coloring. By mixing model colors 976 buff and 985 hull red, you will obtain a deep rust color. Apply this new rust color directly over the camel black brown tracks. These two colors can be used either individually or together to make base scratches and chipping effects for the surface of your model. Step 3. This is the application of Model Wash 514 Dark Brown. Before the wash is applied, it is best to add a clear coat. Use the clear satin varnish supplied with the US Olive Drab Set to protect the work that has already been done. If you dampen the area you wish to apply the pin wash to with water, simply take a small tip brush and a small amount of the wash and touch the area. Through capillary action, the wash will work its way around raised features and into recesses. Step 4. Model wash number 512, dark green. A thin light wash can be applied over the entire model. If you'd like, you can use this color to add pin washes as well. Any of the model washes from Vallejo can be applied in full strength or diluted with water to create filters. This wash is applied in the same manner as the dark brown to enhance the surface details and make them pop. The dark green model wash can be used to darken panels and edges. Step 5. This is the application of Vallejo's pigment number 104 Stone Gray. There are several ways to apply the pigments to get different effects that you are looking for. The pigments can be applied dry, mixed with water, mixed with model washes, model colors, model air paints, and mixed with other various types of mediums. When applying the pigments mixed with water, Place the mixture into the creases and along edges of the raised features and allow to dry.
Once dry, simply take a stiff brush and you can remove the loose pigments. When done with the application of your pigments, use the pigment fixer, which was supplied with the weathering set, to bond the pigments to the model. This will help keep them in place. Weathering of a model is all about layers. If you build up the layers, the depth will increase of the model. So you can revisit the pigments, the washes, or any of the other effects over and over again until you are happy with the model that you're making. Both the AFV series US Olive Drab Painting System and the weathering set for green vehicles from Vallejo are excellent ways to get high quality, multi-tonal finishes to your model. Both of these paint sets are sold just about everywhere today. Please check your local hobby shops and distributors for availability. Thank you.